Hello, hello, it's Nemo. And just for this video, I'm gonna say university instead of college because college in other places outside the United States, it means like secondary school, kind of like a high school. And in French, I think uh, it's pronounced college, which actually means middle school in English. Like this one time I was talking to my cousin uh, who lives in France and he, I told him like, Oh, I'm go. I'm about to go into college, and he was confused. Cause he's like, "You're you still you're still in college," and I was like, "Yeah, I'm about to go to college." So it was kind of weird, but university in a nutshell kind of goes like this. Yes, I got accepted into university. Finally, hopefully I don't have to struggle with my major now. All right, gotta pick my classes. Here's a tip. Don't take too many hours if you can't handle it. Then the university is kind of like this. All right, you better pay your tuition right now. Fork up that $10,000. You want to live here? That's another 10000 You don't have the money? Here's some money, but you got to pay it back with interest. And if you don't pay it back, oh, in like five years, that's like twice the amount. So you better pay it up. Pay up your tuition right now. 5000 right now. Next month you can pay your next 5000 Yo, that's a lot of money. Like, I only get paid like minimum wage. That dude there don't even have a job. You need some money? Well, I'm gonna give you a loan, but you gotta pay that back with interest. So how much will that be? Don't worry about it. But just know that if you don't pay this back, we're gonna come get you later on. Well, dang. Oh, and if you need to live here, that's another 10,000. I mean, if you need money, you should have applied to scholarships and grants last year, for this year, and next year. <sighs> Bro, anybody got time for that? Well, you should have thought about this before you applied here. Man, I'm broke. Hey, mom, dad, you guys got some money? If I got some money I can have. Yo, if you needed money, you should have gotten a job. And then if you work, you still got to pay up so much. Like, even if you work minimum wage, so the national minimum wage in the U.S. is like seven twenty-five, and I'm pretty sure you probably won't even be able to work like full time uh, and study and go to all your classes so hopefully like you saved up the enough money before you even went because that's a lot of money it's possible depending on how much your tuition is so if you go to a university whose tuition is not as much then you should be okay with working like minimum wage or hopefully get paid more because the more you get paid the better the more money you'll have to spend Man, though, broke-ass college students, just like me. Now, don't forget, you still need to eat. And in university, some of them are just going to force meal plans down your throat and make you pay, like, 2000 on average for, like, each of them. I don't know what the actual average is. Or you can go on a typical college diet, like ramen noodles or... Not even ramen noodles. It's, like, instant noodles, the ones that are, like, 60 cents at the most per package. <laughs> That's also a quick way to get malnourished. It's just by eating like one thing the entire time. You won't get much nutrients otherwise. So once you actually get into university and have your classes ready, hopefully your classes that you've chosen weren't filled and you had to take a, like a substitute class for it. Well, hopefully after your applications have been accepted and you choose your classes, they're not full because if they are, Hopefully you can find a substitute so that you're still on track for your degree plan, especially if you want to graduate early or on time, four years, two years, I don't know, whatever your plan is. Then you got to choose what kind of person you want to be like in university, like this kind of person. Bro, why did 
last line up for an 8 a.m. It's a little hard. Where did that come person? I'm so glad there was a bunch of one o'clock classes. I feel great. Gotta sleep in. Class? No, I'm gonna skip today. No matter which one of those you are, just remember you're paying for it one way or another. Either you got that full ride, but I mean, if you're wasting it, that, that full ride should have gone to somebody else, honestly. If you're wasting that time, that money, just remember that university is expensive. Hella expensive, man. Why? Why does it gotta be so expensive? Like, I don't know what the prices of university are in other countries, but it's getting real expensive out here. I can't even imagine what it's gonna be like when my kids, if I ever have any, I really don't know, are gonna go through university. Hopefully they do, but at the same time, man, that's getting expensive to live. Then you gotta study, if you do or not. I don't know what kind of person you're gonna be, but uh, hopefully you study. So you can either be like these kind of people. It's 2 a.m. in the library. Time to go to sleep. Oh yeah. Read like 10 pages. I think I'm good for the day. Good job. Studying. Who studies, nerd? Or maybe you have a nightlife. I don't know. Man, I gotta study all these chapters by Thursday. Uh, one page, two pages. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> then hopefully, at the end of your degree plan, hopefully you graduate. But if you don't, you're gonna end up like this. Oh, I think my degree arrived. Yo, it's empty. Oh, sh I haven't graduated yet, so I don't have a degree. But, uh... I'm gonna get one. Just remember that the amount of work you put in usually kind of correlates with what your GPA ends up being. But not everyone is good at the certain subject that they're studying in whatever class it is, and that class is just gonna make their GPA go from here to whoop. But man, it's hard. It's hard being a student. All that stress, yo. Hopefully you picked a university that's good for you. So much money involved, man. Oh, man. Then there's a GPA scale. Ooh, hopefully you get that close to a 4.0. That also takes a lot of work and a lot of work is really stressful. Hopefully your university experience is a great one and that you graduate, get that degree. Some people drop out, but they still get a good job. And if you're the kind of person, good for you. As always guys, just remember to take care of yourself, take care of others, spread love and peace.